ericmothersmother.com. Let's take a look at Ethereum, and we're going to take a look at Ethereum versus the dollar and Ethereum Classic. If I can find it on this, where is it? Where is it? Oh, come on. All right, here it is. ETC. Now, this is for August 11th, 2018. What I want to discuss here is the risk that I have been talking about for many weeks continues to play out. What is the risk? The risk is the more we move to all-time lows on the monthly MACD, the more we can expect continuation of this slide. So you can see that this month we see a push lower. Clearly why? Because the RSI is moving to all-time lows. It's not a good setup. Now keep in mind, it could get worse. Why? Because if, and of course we don't know that, but if the RSI on the monthly drops below 50, expect a substantial drop on the month it drops below 50. Now remember I gave a warning here when it dropped below the other critical level, which is the RSI 69.1. Now that drop, of course, corresponds with this massive plunge on this month here. And this is for Ethereum Classic. So what I'm saying here is the risk is if it drops below 50 and continues to trade at all-time lows, expect a big down month when that happens. Now keep in mind, for both Ethereum and for ETC, Ethereum Classic, the MACDs are already trading at all-time lows, something I talked about for many weeks. And I warned that the more we drop below zero, the more we trade at all-time lows, the more the MACDs are trading at all-time lows, the risk continues to be to the downside. Now let's take a look also here at Ethereum quickly. And the risk continues here. I'm going to begin with the MACDs. We can see that the MACDs are trading at all-time lows for Ethereum. And as long as the MACDs are trading A, below zero, and B, at all-time lows, the risk continues to be for lower, lower prices. Keep in mind, if you take a look at Ethereum's chart, I've been talking about this bearish look, which is playing out even in the current market, which is that the more we are dropping to all-time lows on the MACD, and the more we are moving below 50 on the monthly time frame, suggests that we are going to see a big down month. And already this big down month is starting to play out. So that's the risk. That as long as all these things are giving the same look, the odds of lower prices are still very high. So one needs to be careful here when trying to buy the cryptos, thinking that they are going to stabilize here. You have to wait for some of these things to resolve to the upside before you can find this as being an opportunity. The risk is still there. The chances of much, much higher prices in the short term, in the coming weeks, coming months, is still very high. Eric Mwadith, mother.com. As always, good luck, peace, and blessings. E, I see. S. Woo!